Welcome to Toy Poloi. Hello and welcome to another video from Toy Ploy. Now a few weeks back I was contracted by a subscriber who said he thought he had a good challenge for me. And today in the post I have received this box with the new challenge inside. So let's open this up and see what I've been sent and see what sort of toy I've got to fix. Here we go, opening it up. Let's have a look inside. So inside, oh look, I've got some instructions here. Oh, it's quite a nice long letter. Wow, lots and lots of bits and bobs. So it looks to me like the challenge is an Action Man Seawolf. Now this is not a toy I've ever had before, but it's certainly something I'd like to have a go at. So let's have a bit more of a rummage and we'll see what is inside of this box. Lots of packing beans, that's what I like, and lots and lots of bits. What are we going here? More bits and bobs. That looks like the top of uh, the sea wolf. And more bits and bobs. Another part to the sea wolf. Wow. More bits. Even more bits. Goodness me. That looks like the seat from inside it. Pretty filthy, but that does look like quite a good seat. More bits and bobs? God. Oh, I think we've got a stowaway here. Look at him. This to me. Looks like a bit of a dilapidated action man. And it is indeed. It's a very sorry looking action man. He appears to be missing, well, missing both his hands. He's got a pretty sorry head, but he does have some quite good bits on him. I get packing beans absolutely everywhere. Even more bits. So this this looks like the main part of uh, the sea wolf, as you can see there, it says sea wolf on the side. So that does give you a full, full clue as to what this is. There's even more bits inside. Goodness me, there's a lot in this box. Keep going down, there's more bits. There's the controller for the sea wolf. And more. What's in here? whole bag of diving bits for Action Man. Even more bits for Action Man. Blimey, this box just keeps on doing. I've still got bits here that I've not opened. Some 
Now that that looks like the bottom section, it's got a weight in it as well. That's obviously how the uh, sub sinks. say this is incredibly well packed. What have we got here? Looks like a diving helmet. And right at the bottom is another stowaway. Another action man. Again, poor guy's been through been through the walls, looks a little bit battled, but he's got a little bottle of rum there, so that's probably keeps him at bay. And he's missing most of that hand and most of that hand. Poor guy. Looks like I've got to find a lot of hands. Is that it? Or that I've got more to come. There's even more. There's some, some hose. I think we've reached the bottom. Blimey, that's a big box of stuff. So I've now organised the bits here on my work desk and you can see there's quite a lot of stuff. This is really going to be quite an action man mega challenge. There's a lot for me to do and a lot of things to sort out. The main challenge is doing the Sea Wolf, of course. There's quite a lot of bits for that, but there's also quite a lot of bits missing. So I think I'm going to have to research that ship, find out what's missing and work out how I can fix the bits I've got because there's a few bits that are broken. There's some fins at the back that uh, I've been supplied new cast versions which haven't been finished off. So I either got to finish the sort of new casts or try and find some vintage replacements. And then of course there's these two action men. There's the sailor here who is in overall I would say reasonable condition but he is missing his hands. He's also got one foot that's a completely different colour which is a bit odd so uh, he needs some work. And then there's this diver action man over here who is in a terrible state. He's missing hands, his face is in a sort of, well, it looks like it's been covered in ink and painted. It looks like he's had a bit of a moustache added to him. And he's also incredibly floppy, so that also needs fixing. But I have been sent some very good instructions here. So lots of information about what's gone on, some instructions for the uh, deep sea diver, and obviously uh, some fresh printed out instructions for the sea wolf. So they're going to help me. So this is going to be a big challenge for me. And I'm actually going to split it into three parts. I'm going to do the Sea Wolf as one set of videos. I will do the Diver Guy as another set of videos. And I will do this Drunken Sailor as a third set of videos. So if you can help me with hints and tips, or if you have spare parts for any of these and would like to donate them, then please get in touch. I have uh, badges and stickers that I send out to anyone who can help me with projects. So keep watching Toy Ploy and we'll see how I get on with this challenge. It's going to be quite a job. There's quite a lot of work to do, but I think all of these figures and this ship can be saved. So I hope this video has been of interest to you and thanks for watching. Thanks for watching Toy Ploy. Subscribe for more great videos. You can also follow Toy Poloi on Twitter and Facebook.